Good afternoon. Thank you so much for having us here at Opportunity Nation. I'm Ann Kress, the president of Monroe Community College. We're in Rochester, New York, which is the part of New York most folks think of as Canada, uh, very close to Secretary Perez's hometown of Buffalo. Um, we are working with our community to build smooth and successful transitions for our graduates from college to career. Our ability to do that is one reason why we can say for every dollar that a student invests in MCC and tuition, they'll see an $8 return. We know that 90% of the graduates in our career and technical education programs find full-time employment in their fields in our region. We're able to do that because we partner with our community. We partner with nonprofits, local government, and most importantly, business and industry. So I am delighted to be joined here today by one of those partners, Lou Romano from Romold. Well, it's an honor to be here. Uh, quite an event, our, our first attendance here. In, uh, I want to describe for you a way that we work with MCC, Monroe Community College, and their Applied Tech Center uh, to, to grow employees for our shop here. Romold is a precision manufacturer, and we've been in business for 18 years. Uh, we have 18 employees, so we're a small shop, uh, but four of those employees are in the New York State Apprenticeship Program. I myself have ser served an apprenticeship and had, had risen through the ranks and ended up uh, owning my own shop now. Um, we have a collaboration with MCC that starts uh, with the advisory board there. And the, what the advisory board does is they ask uh, owners of businesses to come and help them with curriculum so that we design curriculum that meets the criteria of entry level employees coming into the shops. Um, it provides the tools and the skills for job candidates and our current employees. MCC fills a need for industry by creating a pipeline through education for people seeking to enhance their tool making career and they provide hands on training with CAD CAM software and programming, print reading, metallurgy and on and on. After four years of an apprenticeship with our company, our employees can enjoy it at a higher than middle class income between benefits and pay. Um, I'm gonna let Matt here speak about his experience at Romold. So thank you for your time. And uh, through this collaboration with MCC, I think we, we got this. Thanks, Lou, and he's too modest. It's a lab, it's not a shop. It's spotless. I go in there every day, I play with Legos and video games for big kids, and it is awesome. So. Let me tell you a little bit of how I ended up there and my whole path. Started at Brockport High School, the Project Lead the Way program got me into the CAD CAM software, which is computer-aided design and manufacturing software. From there, I still didn't know exactly what I wanted to do. Went to MCC, I checked out a few of the trades that they had training available for, and I ended up getting my associate's degree in precision machining. They helped me there to solve real world problems as well as the, many of the teachers there have been great mentors to me. They prepared me for the workforce in ways that I don't think I could have been prepared for better other places. I started my apprenticeship at Romold after I got my associates and I received more mentoring there from not only Lou, but a couple of the other guys that are there above me now. Now, when I got done, they gave me this card that says I'm a mold maker. The card really doesn't mean a whole lot to me because on my path to getting that card, what they did was they turned me into a problem solver. And that led to my job today. I'm the supervisor of the floor at Roll Mold, and I love my job every day. It is absolutely awesome. And now part of my job is to mentor guys that are in the position that I was in and get them to the spot where I'm at so that they can enjoy the American dream like the rest of us. Thank you. So at Monroe Community College, as you can see, as Lou said, we got this. 
But what we want to do today is to call on every community college and every community and have all of you be ambassadors to go back and bring that call to action so that every community can produce graduates like Matt who see brighter and brighter futures. Graduation isn't the end of opportunity, it is the beginning. Thank you.